Singapore, unable to move on after their affair ended early this year, a married man killed his ex-girlfriend in her flat before jumping to his death from the 10th story unit, the court heard on Tuesday, December 19. Safety supervisor Chang Hong Nam, 49, was found dead at the foot of the block of the flats at around 11 p.m. on May 29. When police officers went up to Ms. Saran Tan B. Leng's home at Block 5208 Tampines Central 8, they saw the sales telemarketer lying motionless on a blood-soaked bed. In an inquiry into their deaths, Senior Investigation Officer Vic Neswaran Ramakrishnan told the court Ms. Tan, 46, died from a stab wound on her chest and two on her abdomen. She also had cuts on her forearms believed to be defensive wounds when Change attacked her with a knife-like weapon. The weapon used to kill her has not been recovered. The father of three first met Ms. Tan about four years ago when he was working as a property agent. They got involved in a relationship and tried to keep it discreet, but his wife later found out about it. She asked her husband to stop seeing Ms. Tan and even went to the divorcee's flat to confront her. When confronted, Ms. Tan denied that she was in a relationship with Change. On Tuesday, SIO Vikneswaran told state coroner Kamala Ponnampalam that the affair ended early this year and Ms. Tan got into a relationship with another married man who was her supervisor at work. Despite this, Change still contacted Ms. Tan as he wanted to meet her but she always made excuses to avoid him. The pair agreed to meet at her Tampines home on May 29 and Mr. Change later jumped to his death after stabbing her. Residents alerted the police and officers who found Ms. Tan's NRIC in Change's possession. Went up to her flat they found her lying face up on a bed, with stab wounds and also bruises around her wrists and ankles. SIO Vic Neswaran said change could have restrained the woman with some cable ties as they were also found at the foot of the block. Neighbors the officers spoke to did not hear any suspicious sounds coming from the unit that evening. The IO said that this was because change, who was bigger in built than MS-10, could have gagged his ex-girlfriend before stabbing her. He added that change sent a message to his wife and jumped off the 10th story balcony. In the message, Read out in court on Tuesday, Mr. Change apologized to his family members and stated that he was not a good father. Ms. Ten's sister and parents were in court but they declined to comment when approached. The coroner will give her findings on January 19 next year.